Check this out. There is a reason black men have not historically been in the home. There is a reason black women have historic, historically struggled on their own to hold households together. Because we dealing with the with the after effects of that's been happening to us for centuries, we get to blame each other and like that. Am I saying that a man individually is not responsible for his children? No, my G, if you're not taking care of your kids and you got the ability and you space trash. to take care of your kids, you a loser, cuz. We not gonna act like prison is not taking our men away. We not gonna act like the hood not taking our men away. We not gonna act like the, the stress of being a provider. Like, bro, men's life expectancy has dropped. The lowest in America, you feel me? And this not be making excuses for you feel me? I'm saying that when we talk about black people, when you, when you talk about like Section 8 and shit like that, make sure you mention the housing crisis that affects majority black women you feel me if we gonna talk about black men not being in the home let's make sure we talk about mass incarceration don't just sit up here and like hurl insults at each other this shit is delicate my g these people tune into this shit. they gonna go home with these opinions in their mouths and beat up on other black people because we say up here bro it's facts that have to do with this conversation aside from the whole you know, uh, black stigma re replace black with Hebrew Israelite or Israelite, and it'll make a lot more sense because everything that he just described has something to do, has everything to do with Deuteronomy, Debarium, chapter 28, verse 15. And you can read through yourselves. I'm not going to go through the whole thing because it's a lot to unpack, okay? But the mass incarceration rate, okay? The, the, uh, the life expectancy rate. All right, the gender wars, all of that in Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter, starting at verse 15 on down is going into the curses of you Hebrew Israelites, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Read it for yourselves to get your own understanding. And if you ask questions, look up Great Millstone. With that being said, Shalom.